Hi, Christy. <laughs> Let me put my chat on my, um, sorry, I just woke up, so <laughs> I had to take a nap. Um, let me pull up my chat real quick. Hello. Hey, Patty. Hi, everyone. Do I sound okay? Hey, Jackie. So good to have you here. I forgot to like message you guys. Well, I was asleep, so I'm like, I hope they remember that it's Thursday and it's eight o'clock. <laughs> so um, today I want to do some, sorry, I have um, Animal Crossing in the background on Twitch. But um, I wanted to do some sewing sticks today. I have like all of my little circular beads and my focal beads. Hey guys. Hi everybody. Oh my gosh, Jackie, I used to play Animal Crossing so much. I haven't played in so long, um, kind of abandoned it. It's so sad. Okay, perfect. I just wanted to make sure I sounded okay. Hello, hey Bree, it's nice to see you again. Um, so I wanted to show you guys the um, sewing sticks that I've done, just, um, probably the two hours that before live started. And then I took a nap because I was so tired. I'm like, I have to take a nap. <laughs> <You're>, <laughs> Christy, your villagers will get guilt you so bad. I know probably half of them moved out of my, um, of my uh, island. It's so funny. But um, this is the first little set that I've made. Isn't it so cute? I thought it was so pretty. No one ordered this one. I just wanted to make one with the books. I just thought it, um, I just thought it was so cute. And like the little pastel colors, I knew like it needed like a little sage in it. So I ended up making this one. I made a ton. So that's the first set that I'm showing you guys. The next set that I'm like really proud of that um, Addison really liked is this little astronaut one, like a little pastel. I played on like the, the little blue part of his um, suit and then the little pink in the ears. I thought this one was cute too. Hey, Stephanie, good to have you here. Oh, yes. Oh, let me add you as a mod, Christy. That's why you said snuggly duckling, right? Am I wrong? I'm pretty sure that's why you said that, right? I'm thinking about it now. I'm like, why did she say that? Let me wait for a response. I, I'm pretty sure that's the Christy that pretty sure. But, um, yeah, made this little astronaut ones. Oh, see, I knew it. I was all like, wait, it clicked. I just woke up. So, you know, my mind wasn't even there. And then I read it again and I was like, wait, that's why she said it. But yeah, made this cute little astronaut one. Thank you for being here, Christy. And then the other one, this is, um, let's see, Ariana, if you're here, I know I talked to you on um, Instagram um, messages. You wanted a cute little llama and you wanted it to be floral. So, and you love orange. So, I thought this was so cute. So, I hope Ariana likes this one. 
I haven't glued them on. I've only glued the books one, the first one that I showed you, but it did really good. Um, it, Terry, it just depends. Like, it doesn't take that long. It just takes a long time, like, sifting through, like, all the colors and, like, putting colors together and taking them off. But honestly, I didn't spend more than, like, I don't know, five to eight minutes on them. They're just really cute, though, you know? And then someone ordered a mom coffee mug, and they wanted black and pink. So I did this one. I thought it would be cute. Bye, Kim. Have a good um, dinner. But yeah, I did this one. Then someone ordered a B1. Um, I'm selling them for $16 plus shipping and handling, which um, I'm thinking of just anybody who messages me on Instagram, just let me know what you want. And then I'll make it, make sure that it's approved by you via Instagram. And then whenever you approve it, I'll make a listing for you on Etsy. And then um, you can purchase it off of Etsy. It's going to have like your your own personal name on it and it'll say custom order for Janelle or custom order for Christy and that's how you're gonna purchase it but yeah I made this cute little bumblebee one they wanted the sage green um, flower on the second stick so I played off of that and I thought these were cute too hi grace The other ones that I made, I've made so many, but the other one that I made was this cute little piggy. I thought it was so adorable. Oh, do you like that one, Jackie? I thought it was cute too, huh? So cute. And then I think this is the last set that I made. And this one was a custom for Shaylin and she wanted fox. She wanted um, neutral, I think. She didn't really care. She was like, it's okay, whatever you want. Hey. But yeah. So I have them all sitting here. Now I got to figure out what I'm going to like buy, what I'm going to purchase to like make them, put them in a cute packaging. I thought that would be nice. So I have to take a look to see what Amazon has or, you know, what kind of long bags there may be. Ooh, hi, Floral Cat. It's nice that you caught my live. Thank you for being here. And um, you said hot pads for your first market in March. That sounds so exciting. You're going to have to let us know how you do. <laughs> Chris, do you like them? Aren't they adorable? Like, girl, I've been like just playing around with um, different just color schemes. And like, I have so many since I bought like so many different size beads. Some of them are like oval. Some of them are marbled. Some of them are, is this a hexagon? Is that what this is? I don't know. Hexagon. Some of them have like floral designs on them. So just like looking through all my beads and like trying to figure out, look at this one. This one's like, I don't know. I don't even know how to explain that, but it's like so cute. The book one again, ugh, that one's my favorite. Dude, I feel like this one's my favorite. This one, I did um, hot glue. This is the only one that's hot glued. The other ones are not. Um, I need to go back and hot glue them. But I was just having so much fun, like, creating them to where I was like, I'll hot glue them later, but they will be hot glued so they can stay on. But, yeah, this is the book one, and I felt like playing on with the pastel colors, especially if you're, like, sorry, that's my dog. Ugh. But if you hear her. But <laughs> I'm, like... <laughs> But um, especially if you are like a yarn lover and you, why is she barking? <laughs> I'm like concerned. I'm like, she, she's like 15. She doesn't, she hardly ever barks. 
I think she heard somebody else barking. But, um, anyways, I'm sorry. I feel like I'm getting distracted. But, uh, I feel like people who crochet also are into reading books. So, I figured maybe someone would like that. Let me read the comments real quick. Oh, yeah, Brie, if you want it, just let me know, and then I can make your um, your listing on Etsy is what I am finally decided that I'm doing to, like, get payment and stuff so um, you guys feel, I don't know, more secure, you know? Bubble tea toppers, I don't. You know, Janelle, and I thought of um, grabbing some, and I didn't. Yes, it looks like opal. Exactly. That's that's exactly what this looks like. Let me grab some water real quick. Olivia, I don't have any cows or cowboy boots, but I did see some. So if you're serious, just message me on Instagram and um, I can actually buy some. <laughs> Brie sold all. Yay. So excited. Those are so cute. Seriously. These were my favorite. Like if you like pastel and if you like pink, literally adorable. I love them. And I don't, I'm not a pink girly. So yes, Brie, you can claim the, um, the book ones. Just message me on Instagram. So like I'm for sure, like I know that these are going to you. See, you also love reading. See, I told you I don't really like reading, but um, I think it's because I was in school for so long. <laughs> but if I feel like I could have been one of them, one of those people, um, and I definitely get people who can who read a lot. Ooh, Sandy, that's awesome! What colors are your baby blankets? It's good to have you here. Book one is my favorite. This one right here, like that tannish pink, it's so pretty. I don't read a lot either, so I I get you. <laughs> Hi, Nicole, right? Your antisocial auntie. Am I correct? I think that I think I think that's right. No, don't be sorry you're late. I'm here. We just started. It's only 8.15, so. Sandy, I didn't find any yarn balls, but I wasn't looking for them either. I need to write that down because this girl forgets everything. And um, yarn balls. And then someone said, um, like, Texas boots. I do have cactuses or cacti, um, for the person who wanted like a Texas, like a boot or something. I don't know if cactuses are your thing or cacti. I do have Highland cows. I do. Oh, I used to love to journal. I definitely get that, get that, um, vibe. Um, just kind of like, this is how I used to journal, like laying in bed and like drawing little cute pictures and writing about my um, day. Also, like I had a, I have a little printer that I would print like pictures of my month out for the month. Like it was such a vibe. See, I knew it. I'm happy I remembered your name, Nicole. I'm not good at remembering names. So if I don't remember your name, I'm sorry. But over time you continually like telling me I promise you I will remember oh yeah Jackie or like listen to podcasts or do you already do that sober granny by Krista at the secret yarn and doing brown light brown and white Ooh, nice <laughs> Stephanie, I don't have any any cats. Um, I have koala bears, axolotls. I have astronauts. Um, this little owl. 
foxes, pigs, llamas. I have the friend's couch. I have two different types of Highland cows. Um, I have cute little dinos. Let's see. I have like roses and leaves. Oh, I have Jeeps. If anybody's a teacher or loves crayons or, you know. I have more little books, but they're like brighter colors like this. Um, this one's white, gray, yellow. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Did you guys see the Highland cows? Oh, I have little goats. They're so cute. The little koalas are in like different colors. Look at these. Those are so cute. I have a ton of these. Like if anybody drinks coffee, I have coffee teach repeat. I thought that was adorable. This one says the same thing. I have this one that says girl boss. Like, yes. And then there's one more. I think it says like mom. Yeah, it's this one. It says mom needs coffee. Mom needs coffee. Yes, I have so many cute ones. I do have bees. I think the only bees that I have left are, let me look for one, are the ones with the yellow wings. But I did have ones with white wings. So if you're okay with the yellow ones, the axolotls are so cute. Like, dude, like I had to buy several packs. I have pink. They come with pink, purple, and blue. Let me. There's the purple one, so adorable. Ooh, Billy Joe, okay. I'll take a look right now. So we can kind of um, make them for you here, you know? Coffee ones. Um, how long are the sticks? You know, they say 20 centimeters, but I, I'm pretty sure that's like the millimeter side size. Um, I actually have a let's let's look because I don't know. But I can tell you. They are approximately 19 inches is what it looks like. Oh, hold on, hold on. Hold on. That's wrong. <laughs> Ignore me. Hold on. They're about seven and a half. Seven and a half inches, almost, almost eight. They're like, they're like between seven and a half and eight. Purple axolotl, just message me on Instagram. I'm about to look at my Instagram DMs and then we can make it on here. So the people who had already messaged me, I already made theirs. I haven't sent them photos just yet. But um, that way I know what colors you want for your, um, for your sewing sticks. Okay, so let's see. Darling Darcy, 
Um, what is your name on here? Or is it the same? I see your message. Um, and you want the book one too. Do you want like different colors? I use three millimeter, three and a half for the um, size of the knitting needles. I don't have any turtles. I wish I could find some. There was like maybe one, but I didn't really like them. I don't have any bunnies, sadly, no bunnies. Yes, Billy Joe, I definitely can. Oh, I didn't know that. That's cool. I'm reading your message on Instagram. Yes, and Billy Joe, it's going to be, I'm going to put like custom order for Billy Joe on Etsy. So you're able to purchase it. It's not going to have a photo of your sewing six. It's just going to have a photo of my logo. So no one knows, you know, like no one tries to take it from you. It's just going to say your name on it. Yes, you can see the owl one again, of course. Y'all just ask away and I can tell you. I also have, is this a hedgehog or a porcupine? I don't know, but I have this one. It's so cute. This is the owl one. It's kind of like muted tones. So adorable. I have another fox one if anybody wants a fox. Yeah, for right now, I only have this style of foxes. Oh, yes. Yeah. So it you won't pay until um, I make the listing, which I'm not, I'm probably honestly not making the listing until like next week because I have to, um, I want to hot glue them. I need to find some um, bags because I want to make sure that I uh, package it up really nice for you guys so I don't want to just throw them in um, a poly mailer I want to try to find some cute packaging for it so I'm gonna look for that this weekend and hopefully um, Amazon's able to deliver it by next week and I'll put the listing up but I'll definitely message you guys uh, um, when the listing is up and of course to confirm that you like your um, your sewing sticks I'm not just gonna not give you an option hedgehog <laughs> I think I kept saying porcupine and I'm like someone messaged me or left a comment they were like I think that's a hedgehog I'm like oops <laughs> leave it to Melly because I mess up a lot <laughs> and that's okay um let's see let me accept your I have a couple of messages that I'm reading through on Instagram to see if we can make a, um, some sewing sticks on here. Let's see. Purple axolotl for knitting sticks, of course. Light blue, then purple, and light blue are my favorite colors. Otherwise, use whatever colors you think look good. Perfect. So let's make this one. Since we got a message that has like direct what they want so they're wanting a purple axolotl this little guy and I'm just gonna do like the colors of it on here and then when we like whenever I get off I'll start hot gluing these um, because that's gonna take forever <laughs> but I just want you guys to like see it so um, you know what you're getting um, let's see Oh, yeah, for sure, Billy Joe. Thanks. Um, they're silicone beads. I think they're 12 mils. Um, they are 16 for the um, sewing sticks. So you get two, and both of them kind of have like a focal bead on top. 
and then you get like smaller beads at the bottom and then it just kind of depends like this one has two really big beads so I kind of did two smaller beads but like some of these have like four beads in them it just depends on how I feel I guess um but this bead is a lot smaller than this one so I added a couple more so kind of you know making sure that everybody kind of gets the same I don't want anybody to feel like I didn't do, you know, like my, I guess you can say like it was unfair. So knitting needles, I'm using three and three and a half. Um, honestly, I, it just depends on what size um, beads you get, but the standard is like 12. So I honestly would recommend three. I was saying for a while, three and a half for the um, knitting needles, but now that I've like worked it in, you can do threes. Um, they go in a lot smoother, but three and a half, they are kind of tugging. Oh yeah, Christy, I remember you said that, the kebabs. <laughs> I'm excited for, for you to get some then, so. But yeah, okay, let me do this real quick. Light blue and then purple and then light blue okay so let me look at my beads so we do have light purple we have this we have this cute little oval one too it's adorable so i'm thinking maybe white and then i know they said i know they said blue So let me look for blue here. Let's see, light blue, then purple. Thank you, Crystal, you're so sweet. Look at that, that's cute. And then I do have this bigger purple bead. It's a little bit lighter. Thank you, you let me know if, um, if you want me to change it, of course. Like, if you don't like it, don't say you love it. <laughs> Cause this is yours, it's staying with you. So I want you to get something you like, not something that you half like just because I made it, you know? So we do have this purple, it's not the same. That one's not the same color either. We have like this, I think that looks nice. Oh my gosh, Sandy, yes, right? Like an addiction for sure, especially with all the beads. Like I'm already like, ooh, which ones do I need to make for myself? Like, I need to put some apart and, like, make them for me because these are adorable. And then to stabilize your plushie with these, like, look. Let me just put one in one of my plushies. Hold on. Imagine you stabilizing the head to sew this on. <laughs> with your little, you know, isn't that cute? <laughs> it's adorable. And then I, my favorite one is gonna, it, it's just, it's this one right here. So throw it in there. Look at that. It even matches a dino, seriously. Like these are adorable. I like them. And then I I was looking at pricing and stuff and a lot of people sell them for like over 20 bucks. <laughs> And I, I don't know. I just want to price them for 16 because I, I think, um, I think they're worth around there. And, um, hopefully the shipping is not too bad, but I'm not the one that, um, calculates the shipping. Etsy does that. So please don't come at me for the shipping. Cause I know sometimes when I buy stuff on Etsy, I'm like $6, why are you charging me that much? <laughs> so it, it's not me. It's Etsy. They take their their commission too, you know? Oh, thank you, Oliver. That's so sweet. Yes. If anybody wants any stitch markers, definitely go 
go to um, Stitches by Patti's um, Instagram. She she slays with these um, custom stitch markers. I have three of them. And look at her packaging. Isn't that so cute? Look at that. She made me these two elephants. And look how cute they are. And then this little piggy. Dude, this little piggy. And they're all like little crystal beads. Adorable. It's funny because someone in my, I think it was Jackie, in my last uh, vlog, I was talking about how I use like this furls hook to put all of my, like my cute stitch markers on. And Jackie was like, that's an expensive, <laughs> that's an expensive um, stitch marker holder. And it is, it really is this furls hook. No, no lie. Very expensive, but it sure is getting good to get it sure is getting used because I don't crochet with it. So I just thought it was adorable. I see. I knew it was you, Jackie. Yes, definitely. And Patti is in here guys. So definitely go and check out her Instagram. It's stitches by Patti. Her stitch markers are really amazing. So definitely go check her out. Okay. Um, let me look cause I'm pretty sure I got more, uh, messages. So let me finish this axolotl one. I'm thinking of doing, did you say you like the white on here? Um, Ashley, was that okay? Cause if so, I can play on with the white on this other side. Kind of like do something like this. Sorry, I got to put this one down. I'm telling you, these suckers are, you got to have a little bit of strength to put these in. So, and then with a dab of glue, like not saying that they're not going to move because they are for sure, but like they're in there. <laughs> oh, okay. Okay. Perfect. Yes, yeah, Stephanie. She also has a YouTube channel. You need to go check her out. She does so much. She's also in school. Like, seriously, Patti is... I don't know how she does it. My friends are amazing. Um, let me see. We do have this little lavender one that can go on top. And then we can put another... Let me see if I can find, like, an actual oval blue bead... We have this one. That one's cute. And then now we just need a topper. Let's see if I can find like a... I don't know if I'm talking soft. I'm sorry. I don't mean to. <laughs> I And if I have um, RBF, I'm so sorry. <laughs> when, I, when I start like focusing, like really focusing, I... My face starts to change, but I don't... I don't... It doesn't mean anything. I just... Trust me, it doesn't mean anything. Um, do you like flowers, Ashley? We can do like a little purple moment. If not, I have like a white topper. We can do a white topper. You do, you do. What do you think of this? Perfect. So this is yours, Ashley. Okay. And I'll remember because I have your message on Instagram. So let me write it down too, because I'm notorious for forgetting things because I do have people in my messages just, you know, wanting to talk. So let me write your name down. And then you got the purple axolotl and then the light purple flower with light purple flower. Perfect. I'm so happy you like it. Um, let me see. Sorry. Let me look.
Okay. Oh, thank you, Ohana. That's so sweet. If you, if anybody does want me to do one for them, just message me on Instagram. I think I see two messages, so we're doing two more. So I'm excited. I'm so happy that you guys are here. <laughs> yeah, Ashley, I'm excited to see that. <laughs> You're going to have to post a, a little reel, at least with your hands and like the, um, the sewing sticks. Yeah, they're so adorable. The koalas are so cute, Bati. Yes, welcome in, everybody. Thank you, Christy. I did. I showed the astronaut. Oh, my God. He's so adorable. Let me show it again. No one has claimed this one or anything so that I've seen. But isn't that so cute? All these pastels. And there's different ones. There's one that comes with like um, sagey, like greenish instead of like the pink around the ears or whatever. Or the, you know. Ooh, I need to buy some galaxy beads. That would be pretty. Or like some glow in the dark ones that I saw. That'd be cute. Okay, let me move on. Sorry, I'm going to ignore the chat for a second. Okay, Rose, are you here? You just messaged me on Instagram, so I think you're here. <laughs> Let me turn this page. So we have Rose. And she said she's wanting the fox, the fox sewing sticks. So Rose, do you like these right here? Like, do you want some similar? This one's already taken, but I can, I have another fox and I have these same beads. So we can do the same exact ones. If you're wanting like this exactly, just let me know. Rose, are you here? Junkie yarn. I um, is that a brand? Um, all the yarn that I have behind me is Premier Parfait Chunky. Um, I'm charging 16 for them plus the shipping and handling that Etsy, whatever they charge. But yeah, um, my base is 16 is what I'm charging. Rose, I don't see a message from you. But this is what I have, the fox, for the fox. Um, until I see her name. Oh, hey. I see you, I see you. Terry Chronicles, that's why. Okay. Terry Chronicles. Did you like these? Do you want some exactly like this? Or are you wanting like a different color palette with the fox? No, these are um, silicone beads, so you can put them on, like, charms if you want, or, like, pins as well that I've seen, because they have a hole from top to bottom, and um, these are used solely for, like, people who crochet and, like, do, like, plushies, so it's to, like, stabilize the head or stabilize a leg, so you're able to sew it on without, like, sewing it on crooked. Oh, yeah, we can do a different focal bead. Um, what color were you thinking? So you like the rest of it. We can definitely keep it that way. Let me grab. Some right here. Hold on. I want these. Oh, God, I'm happy that it's very calming. <laughs> okay. So let me look through these beads real quick. Um, Rose, if you want to just 
in the chat if you want to say specifically like you want the same colors right and you want the second focal bead different so i got you girl i got you i'm just looking for these beads real quick The color palette, a different second focal bead. Yeah, perfect. Of course. So we have your main one here. <laughs> you suck at colors. I'll take a look to see what I have right now. Oh, Bati, thank you. I'm so happy you guys. I was like really nervous. I'm like, maybe no one's gonna like, like this, like. It might be too slow or, you know, I don't know. Okay, let me look here. I wish you guys could see. I wish I had like a second camera or something, but you know, I have all of these. I also have, I've dedicated this thing to be like my sifter, like to like look through my beads. I wish I had a bigger one, but it wouldn't fit. It wouldn't be able to fit on my um, table with, um, with my tripod and stuff. You finished your AirPod wristlets? wristlets? Yes. That's awesome. I honestly think maybe like a big white one on top. What did they say? I didn't, I didn't look, I didn't see. Loving this too is making me feel crap. Yes, Brie. Like, that's exactly what I want from you guys. Like, I want you guys to get, like, inspired and, like, craft. My name is Melly Inspired Crochet. Like, <laughs> it goes perfectly. Um, let me look. So, I'm thinking if I'm doing, like, a... Do you like the white one? Do you think that would be okay for, like, the top? Or we can play on this orange here. <laughs> dang <laughs> I'm loving this too it's making me feel crafty good okay let's see we can also do like a tan I feel like tan would um would be nice thank you for watching my videos Tan, um, or like, let me see. Hold on, I got you, girl. I'm looking through my stuff. That's why I'm being quiet. Ooh, maybe this color? Hold on. We can also do this color. Okay. Hi, Thomas. It's nice to have you here. We're just making um, sewing sticks. If that's something you're interested in watching, you're welcome here. Anybody's welcomed here. Yes, please don't spam or ask for shout outs because you will get on timeout and then uh, my mods will either remove you or they'll put you on timeout again. So it's up to them. I was thinking like the darker orange, but then I was thinking maybe like the lighter colors on the belly. So maybe hold on.
maybe that. I don't know if you like this one. I can definitely go for a different color too. <laughs> You're around boring people all day, Thomas. <laughs> Um, let me see. I can also, let me see. There's also a leaf, actually. Actually, there's a cute little leaf that I can do. Do you like leaves? And it goes great with the, um, the fox's tail. What do you think about that? Isn't this cute? I think this is cute. It even has like a curved edge on the leaf. It's a cute, cute little detail. We can also change these out if you don't like one of them. It will take me forever to pick. <laughs> I am too. I'm the same way. Sometimes um, giving the artists like creative freedom, they'll know. Um, this color right here you're talking about, we can take that off, girl. We also have like a rose. Do you like this color? We can change this bead out and do a rose. Oh, my leg is getting tired. Sorry. You definitely should. Make some hooks. We also have cl a clear bead. You said yes. Perfect. So, hold on. Let's see. Did you like the way it was? This color, this one, and then the rose. I feel like I took it off too soon. Did Thomas ask what we were knitting? <laughs> it's okay. Some of us knit, but um, crocheting is something I'm pretty, maybe someone said it already, but it's something you can't replicate. Oh, you like the leaf. Oh, okay. Yeah, for sure. This, you like this, right? Hi, Avery. You definitely should crochet. You should, um, I always ask, I always tell people to start with a, um, a scarf. You said yes to the leaf, right? Okay. Now, do you like this pair? Um, sorry, I don't, um, I don't think I have any beginner tutorials for, um, I actually, I don't to learn how to crochet, but I'm telling you, there's tons of great people who, um, have beginner tutorials here on YouTube and you can definitely learn how to crochet. That's how I learned how to crochet a couple years ago. So definitely look, just look up beginner tutorials to crochet and it'll pop up. Oh, thank you, Avery. That's so sweet. True, Sandy. True, true. But maybe you can make your way up to a scarf. Oh, thank you, Thomas. That's very kind. The crochet community is actually pretty mellow. Like, I don't think we're too, too bad. And um, most of us are, you know, 
like to support each other in our small businesses and our small ventures. Okay, perfect. So we will count this one for you. Fox and leaf. Perfect. So I added that one for you, girl. Let me take a look at my DMs. I have a couple more. We have Daisy, Floral Cat on here. You want two sets. The Yellow Winged Bee, perfect, and the Hedgehog. For the bee, you wanna do green, pink, and purple. Okay, let me write that down real quick. Um, oh, I'm like, where's my pen? It's in my other hand. It's in my other hand, Melly. You have two hands. <laughs> Okay, Daisy Floral Cat, Yellow Wing Bee, and you want Green, Pink, Purple, Hedgehog, you want Blue, Red, and White. Oh, like Sonic's a hedgehog. Yes. I just read that. That's so cute. Let me accept your message here. I'm reading it, but I'm not accepting it. Okay. Perfect. Let's take a look. Oh, thanks, Sandy. Let me catch up on some of these messages. Okay, I'm caught up. <laughs> All right, so let's start with um, the B. I think that one's gonna be adorable. So we got the cute little B here. Let me find the hedgehog since I'm in here already. Cute little ones. So let me grab my knitting needles here okay so for the b you want green pink and purple let me take a look at these beads and daisy floral cat if you're here i'm sure you are um are you wanting light colors or are you wanting dark colors green pink and purple because we do have like this green, right? But then we also have like this minty green. Oh, thank you, Thomas, for subbing. I really appreciate it. It really does help my channel out. So we have like this type of green. We have like oval beads as well. Light colors for the bee. Okay, perfect. Answers my question. So. Let's see, green, pink, and purple. Let me play around with this for a second and then I'll show you. What is everybody working on? I think only a, um, Sandy was maybe one of the only ones that said what she was working on. So I'm interested, I wanna know. While y'all are watching, what are you guys being productive? What are y'all doing? Let me look through all this. We have this one too. Hmm. Oh, that's cute. Patty, you need to finish your turtles. Do it. <laughs> Knitting the blanket I frogged during the last life. Girl, Nicole. <laughs> Is it going better than the first time? Cotton candy colored bees. Oh, those are so cute. I bet those are adorable. The hot pads. Oh yes, you, you did tell me about that. So what do you think about this, Daisy? 
Just got home from work working on doing nothing for the rest of the night. That sounds like a vibe. <laughs> A cardigan in your Samba. Oh, Brie, I'm so excited to see Samba come to life. I freaking think she's so cute. She's literally, I know she's not the top, but she's the top of the food chain to me. <laughs> or at top of the crochet chain to me. <laughs> oh, a yellow duck. Cute. Crochet Groves has um, some cute patterns. Hello. Thank you. I appreciate the, um, the compliment. Flamingo keychain, awesome. Oh, good, good, Nicole. Or, yes, Nicole. Okay, perfect. So that'll be your first one. And then let me do the second of this. Hi, hello, welcome in. Rainbow turtles with posh yarn. And posh is elite. Seriously. Hi, Molly. Oh, a duck swing. I've seen those on Instagram. They're so cute. I saw that. Wait, is that the one that um, Lottie posted on her stories? That is literally so cute. I saw it and I was like, it's the one with the um with the ice cream chunk on the on the on the um tail, right? Oh, thank you. Oh, you, do you mean the size knitting needle? It is um, a size three and three and a half. Yes, I'm from Texas. Why? Can you hear my um, my accent? <laughs> I'm a nurse. What do I do for a living? I'm a nurse. Okay. Now that I've read through the comments, let me do the other side of this B real quick. So I'm thinking maybe adding some, do you want the exact same thing on this side, um, Daisy? Or what do you think? Are you serious, Thomas? Are you joking with me? You're, you're kidding, right? <laughs> There, because there's not a boring, there is no boring people when you're a nurse. <laughs> yes, your dragon came out adorable. I freaking love that. That's going to sell so fast. Unless that was a custom order. Um, psh, beautiful. Wait, wait, wait. Um. So are you wanting the same color palette on the second stick or no? Oh, that okay, that's why. <laughs> I'm just kidding, but no, I, I get you. Twinsies. The wrench means that they're my moderators, so they have the power to um, put you on timeout, remove you if you say something inappropriate. Um, they just have a little bit more, um, you know, they keep the peace and they're amazing at it. So definitely don't disrespect them. They're here to make sure the live goes smoothly for me. Um, so they're pretty amazing. Jackie, Christy, and uh, Stephanie. Okay, let me go back to Daisy. Daisy, are you still in here? And do you want the same thing on this side? I feel like I've been I've been asking you. <laughs> I 
Oh my gosh, that hour went by so fast, guys. Um, are my mods able to stay on for another like 30, 45 minutes? If not, we can get off. Um, just depends on you guys. Okay, Jackie's good. I think we ran late last time too. <laughs> okay, Stephanie, thank you. I really do appreciate it. Same colors. Do you do you have a flower for the second one? I do. Um, wait, am I tripping? Was this for this? Was this not for Terry Chronicles? Oh no, it was not. I'm so sorry. I'm tripping. I'm tripping hard <laughs> for no reason. Um, I do have a flower. Let me look for it real quick. Hold on. Were you wanting a, like a lavender flower or I'm so sorry. Or like a rose. We have a rose. I'm making, um, sewing sticks for people who crochet. Yeah, we do have a rose, and then let me see if we have those other flowers. We have a leaf. We have these cute leaves. Lavender would be great, perfect. That answers my question. Let me see if I have one, hold on. If not, I found a pink one, so. another lavender one but I don't think I do do you think pink will be okay what do you think okay perfect we'll do pink and then um, we can do like cute little blue Hmm. Sorry, was that? <laughs> Did someone say bad ASMR? Sorry. I didn't know you could hear me rolling all these um, beads around. <laughs> That's funny. So we can do that. Um... Sewing sticks are, thank you. Sewing sticks are just what holds your plushie together so you're able to sew it on. Um, like if you're able to sew on a leg or a head correctly instead of it being all crooked. That's what that is. We have that. What do you think? Or should I change this to purple? I can do that. I just gotta find a purple bead. We do have a circular purple. What do you think? Okay, the white bead is good. Perfect. I was just about to like change it out. Perfect. Okay, 
So here's this one. Let me write it down. Yellow bee and then a pink flower. And I'll put colorful because it's so colorful and pretty. I'll remember it like that. Perfect. So we have that one. And then we can work on the hedgehog for you. And you were wanting blue, red, and white. So, and I think someone asked a question. I got them from Amazon. I got some from Timu as well. Do you have a lavender astronaut bead? I think I do. Let me look real quick. I have blue, pink, green, mint, yellow, um, and red. I don't know if I have a blue. I thought I did. Or purple. I'm sorry. I don't know if I have a purple. Maybe it didn't come with a purple. Okay. So let's work on your porcupine. You said blue, red, and white. Grab some of these little guys wrong. I want to use up all my threes first. I don't have a sloth. I do. I love scary movies. Um, mostly I crochet. I mean, I knit as well, but I crochet more than knit. Okay. Let's start this. Let's see. Blue, red, and white. It sounds like the American flag. <laughs> oh, Brie, you want to get another set? Yeah, if I don't get them get to them all today, guys, I will be on live again on Tuesday. And I don't think my um, stuff will come in, unless Amazon's that quick. But I don't think my stuff will come in before Tuesday. Like, I'm trying to get packaging for this. So, I will be live on Tuesday. And I will be doing the same thing, maybe for half the time. It depends on how many, you know, people actually want to get some. Um, if not, you know, then I can crochet. But if you guys you know, one or the other, I can make these for you guys on here. Um, you can still message me. Um, I can still send photos, things like that. So hello. Hi, Annette. Okay. Perfect, Brie. Perfect. Okay. What do you think of this, Daisy? Um, I do have a bunch of stickers that, um, I always put in my, um, my stuff. So I have those and then I have stickers of my own that everybody gets cause I love stickers. So I made a ton of these to intentionally like give out with orders. So, um, this is another one. So you get like different types of stickers and then this one too, like of my logo so yeah put the white bead on the bottom of course so you want white red blue 
And like I said, I'll be gluing the these, like hot gluing these on later. I just want to make sure you like the placement before I, of course, secure them. What do you think? Okay, perfect. Let me work on your second one then. Um, are you wanting like the same colors? Maybe the same way? And then maybe like a big white focal bead on the top? Let's see what that looks like. <laughs> Stella. <laughs> I do have a lot of yarn, don't I? Right? Isn't it cute, Amy? I, I think it's adorable. Daisy did a um, good job with the colors she wanted. Hello, I'm just making sewing sticks. Just like for plushies. Let's see. I'm trying to look for another blue bead. I have blue, just not like that exact. Oh, I think I found it. Yep. Nope, I did not. That is not the same blue. Hold on. Oh, thank you. Thank you, Daniel. Or Danielle. Is it Danielle or Daniel? I don't like saying people's names wrong. Y'all are more than welcome to come. <laughs> so sewing sticks. So sewing. Okay, Daniel, thank you for um, telling me. Yeah, they're 12 mils. And then sewing sticks are to stabilize any type of body part that you want to sew on to your crochet plushie. So we, you know, crocheters use them a lot. You can definitely just use knitting needles, of course. Um, those are pretty inexpensive on Amazon and stuff. You can use the wooden ones, the plastic ones. These are just a cuter and funner way to like love your, um, your makes. Okay. Sorry, I'm still looking for this blue bead. It's in here somewhere because it had a brother. I think I found it. Yay, I found it. I did, I did. It's so exciting. Oh, you getting off? Bye, Fatih. I'll text you later, girl. It's okay. Thank you guys for joining. Y'all have a good night. What do you think of this? Or do you want me to change this? Or do you want me to change these? Bye. If you message me on Instagram, I can. And then it'll be up on Etsy for you to purchase with your name on it. Perfect. Perfect. We got another one done. Yay. I think I'm probably only going to do one more. So let me write this one down. So we know this one's daisies. Okay. We have Connie. She wants pastel, purple, pink, 
and blue, maybe an axolotl or a flower. Connie, are you here? If so, Connie, I can make your um, flower and or axolotl. Oh, thank you. That's so sweet. Annette from, from where? Oh, perfect. I'm excited for you to get yours, Daisy. Oh, yes, I do remember. I remember your name, but I'm like, sometimes I'm like, was it the person? Was it not the person? But yes, welcome to, welcome to the stream, girl. It's good to have you here. Hi, Fiona. No, Thomas, I don't stream every night. I only stream Tuesdays and Thursdays for about an hour to an hour and a half. So it just um, depends. Pastel Axolotl. So I only have the darker ones. They look like this. So they're light in the middle and they're dark on the outside. So I have pink purple and blue is there one that you like or do you want to just do well good Annette I'm happy to hear that like happy to hear that you're not in danger is is what I mean not that you're going to court of course The purple one. Perfect. And then you said, let me look. Yes, I, I remember talking to you, um, Liliana. Um, I think I think I may have wrote yours down. We'll get to yours. If not today, I'll message you um, or I'll email you about it. I think I wrote you back. Um, if you wrote me within the last hour and a half or so, I haven't seen it, but I will get to your email. So let me look. You said you want pastels, purple, pink, and blue. Perfect. Perfect. Let me... Pastel, purples, pink, and blue. Let me write yours down, Connie, real quick. This is the last one I'm going to be doing today, but um, we can definitely message. And let me get through the messages, guys, because I do get a lot of messages. Um, so don't feel like I'm ignoring you if I don't like message you real quick, but I promise you I will get to you, okay? Don't feel like I'm ignoring you. I promise I'm not. <laughs> uh, let's see. So we're doing purple axolotl, and then you want pastel, pink, purple, and blue. Perfect, and then a flower on the other side, right? Okay. Let me look. Yes, Tuesdays and Thursdays I live stream just for an hour to an hour and a half. Oh, thank you, Karen. That's extremely sweet. <laughs> I know I am. Anytime some, if, if you don't want to hear yes and you want someone to tell you no, don't buy that, don't come to me because <laughs> I will be the one to tell you, get it, do it. <laughs> you deserve it. <laughs> oh, you're so sweet, Jackie. <laughs> okay, getting back to this because this is the last one we're doing. Let me get the needles out of here. I'm excited to find some packaging so I can like 
you know, make it look presentable for you guys. I think that would be so cute. So I'm ready to like look on Amazon. I haven't yet, but I'm ready. You said pastels, pink, purple, and blue. So let's do these. Yeah, that, that's cute. Okay. And then blue. I, I'm one of those that loves to add white every single time, every single chance that I get. Because I think it just looks, it makes it. So, let me take a look. Thank you guys so much for um, being here with me today. I really do appreciate it. Um, it really does help my YouTube channel grow and like this community grow. Our little crochet corner, you know, a little corner on the internet here. Um, if you guys are here and you like crochet content, um, I do a lot of vlogs um, and I talk a lot. <laughs> I talk a lot. If you like that, that kind of stuff, make sure you you subscribe, guys, okay? Um, don't subscribe to unsubscribe, though, because I had a lot of people subscribe in my last live, and then throughout the couple days, they were unsubscribing, and I'm like, then why would you subscribe? Why would you subscribe? Make it make sense, because it doesn't make sense. But, um, yeah. No hard feelings, though. Like, if you don't like my content, don't subscribe. Like, I definitely, definitely get it, you know? Okay. This is fun. I'm glad you're having fun. Good. Good. I love that. I'm happy that you, um, that you continue to crochet. I'll keep this up. <laughs> well, thank you, Thomas. That's so sweet. I know you asked everybody where they live. Where do you where do you live? I don't think we asked you. Now we want to know about you. Um sorry, I'm making Connie's right now. Connie, are you still here? I have something. You let me know if you like it. If you don't, we can switch it, okay? Oh, thank you. <laughs> Jackie, we're both the middle ground girl. I know you're you're like, you know, you're like, I'm older than you, but I think we're the middle ground. Caroline girl, start a channel. Do it. Okay. What do you think about this? Do you like it? Do you not like it? Do you want me to change the colors? Do you want this to be pink instead? We have pink down here. We have two purple, then white and white, and then blue and blue, and then purple. <clears throat> it depends on what your target audience is, Mia. Depends on what you want to sell. I'm waiting on Connie. Ireland, Ireland looks so pretty, like for real. Sorry guys, I was I was looking at an Etsy thing. Connie, are you still here? Oh, there you go. That's perfect. I'm actually for sure. Okay, perfect. Then I will keep yours like this. I think it's so adorable. Let me give you a close up. Look at the eyes. I think the eyes are so cute. So, okay. 
purple axolotl and then we have a blue hexagon for the second bead that's how i'm gonna keep up with um what goes with what i wish i had like little rubber bands to like rubber band them together but i don't Mia, there's a ton of stuff to crochet on Instagram, I'm telling you. And then you can also watch, like, my free Instagram pattern videos. That should give you a lot of ideas um, for, like, free patterns that you don't have to pay for that I try out. And I kind of tell you if I like them or not, um, kind of what was, like, the, um, you know, if they were good, if they weren't, if I had issues with them, things like that. Um, I'm actually going to be doing a dino one for Saturday's video. So check that one out. It's going to be a, um, trying out free dinosaur Instagram patterns. This is a free one. I have other ones over here. They're so adorable. I've been working on a ton of them. So just cute little things. I have several, so if you want to check that video out, it comes out on Saturday. I'm filming it tomorrow, so I'm staying up tonight to crochet, guys. Like, when I get off of this live, I'll be crocheting my little heart out and watching The Rookie. So, or Fortnite Twitch stream. I love Fortnite, so I love people playing Fortnite, too. So, um, let's see. Well, Jordan, that's a good way of starting to just selling to your friends. That's exactly what I did because I started crocheting back in October of 2020. And I only started selling this, well, in November. Was it November? Yeah, my birthday. Jackie was the first one to ever purchase anything from me. And I'm so happy that she is still here with me. So I love Jackie. Oh, yeah, the dinos are so adorable. You guys... There's more coming. Um, sneak peek of another one I'm working on. That's a free pattern on Instagram. So if you want to check that video out that's coming out on Saturday, it's a plug. Um, subscribe to my channel so you can watch it on Saturday. Yeah, lots of free tutorials here on YouTube as well. Exactly. Mary makes free dino. I'm gonna have to let me let me write that down. Mary makes free dino. Oh, I'm gonna have to look at it later. Um, let me see if I got any more messages. It's nine thirty. Sorry, I just read y'all's messages um, from my mods. Um, Mariah, I think I have Mariah's. I'm pretty sure I have Mariah already. Oh, Stephanie, you messaged me, girl. Heck yes. I can make yours. Um, yours can be the last one I make. Are um, the rest of my mods okay with that? We have to make room for Stephanie. I, I just saw your message, girl. I was looking at just like the requested messages. So if y'all are okay, we'll make Mar um, we'll make Stephanie's right now. Okay, that'll be the last one. So that should be 15 minutes and we're off of live. Okay, guys? Okay, let me find... See, you see how I suddenly forget like, dude my memory. You said Al. Okay. Stephanie. Yes. We'll end off on a good note. We'll end off with Stephanie's order. I'm so excited. Um, and just because you're my mod girl, you'll probably get a little extra. <laughs> I really do appreciate you guys being here. Like you, you don't understand like keeping the peace and everything. It, it's really good. Any colors that go with the Al. Perfect. Okay. 
Mr. Little Hoot Hoot here. He's so cute. I think he's adorable. You guys are awesome, man. Like, seriously. Like, literally, this is how many um, knitting needles I have left. Like, y'all are freaking awesome. I do have more coming, so don't worry if you... If I didn't make yours here tonight, I have more coming, but um, it may be a week until I make yours. But, Stephanie, I want to know, what is your favorite color? Because I know you, you're you okay with whatever colors, but I, I want to know what colors you like. What colors can I go with? <laughs> Jackie, I love that, girl. Oh yeah, um, you order through my Instagram direct messages. So just message me on there, I'll look at it. And then I am going live on Tuesday. So if you catch the live on Tuesday, I can make your, um, your knitting needles then. If not, I can make them uh, before that and just send you a picture um, through Instagram DMs. Someone asked about the, you are co completely correct. I did say that I was going to show you guys how I, um, pink is my favorite color. Perfect. Stephanie. Al. Pink. Okay. So we got stuff to go with. Okay. Um. So I did tell someone that I was going to show them how I glue on safety eyes. So I do have to do that because I did promise that. So I do have this one that needs their eyes glued. So I'll show you. I have my glue gun right now going. So while that warms up, I will do this owl right now. Promoting a pattern definitely is takes a lot of work. That's why you do tester calls and stuff. Um... Make sure you're using tags on your reels and your photos because that can really make your pattern, you know, go kind of viral. Um, also, whenever you do pattern tester calls, you definitely um, need to consider who you're picking because you definitely want um, people that are willing to promote your pattern because that is what it's all about, really. You really want the people that you choose to like be in love with your pattern and kind of like promote it for you as well because your following is not their following, you know? So the more people that see it, the more eyes on it, the more, you know, it'll work. Okay, so we're starting with this. And if you don't like it, Stephanie, let me know. We can change the colors, girl. This is not set in stone because I haven't hot glued it on. So, No, I've never served in the military. Heading out for the night. I hope to catch your next week. Perfect. Put the bell notifications on and you can definitely catch me, um, Thomas. Have a good night, though. Thanks for hanging out with um, us. Um, old ladies crocheting. <laughs> what do you think of a more neutral owl, Stephanie? What do you think of that? Hi, it's good to see you on here. <laughs> I just met old ladies because of like, you know, like the stigma of crocheting and having a lot of yarn and, you know, being old, but we're not old. Okay, perfect. I love it too. I think it's so cute. It plays on. I'm thinking of using that blue on the, your second, your second um, knitting needle. I think that would look nice. So let me find these colors here real quick.
make sure you guys are liking the live. It really helps me out. See, me too. I'm 32 and I feel old. But people always say, people always say, you're not old, you know? But I feel it. I do feel it. It might be my big girl job though, you know? I don't know. I feel like that's what it may be. That's why I feel so old, but because I've been a nurse for quite a while. And I literally mean quite a while. <laughs> um, ooh, maybe that. Let me see. I've been tired since I was 30. That is definitely a mood. See, that's how I feel. I turn 30 and I feel terrible. Not terrible. I'm I'm exaggerating. Don't don't listen to me. But um I just don't feel as energized as I normally do. And that could be my vitamin D deficiency. Don't come at me. But but <laughs> I'm blaming the the el the old, the age. That's what I'm blaming. <laughs> don't come at me, please. Do you like flowers, Stephanie, or do you think you want like a hexagon or whatever this is? No, Jazz, I'm 30. I'll be 31 this year. <laughs> a lot of people get surprised, but I do have like 70 year old parents. <laughs> I have older sisters, so. A diamond. Okay, okay. It's a diamond. Love flowers, but the hexagon is cute too. Well, let's look at both of them. And then you can decide what you want. Um, I kind of want to switch this color out. Hold on. I had it done, but I want to switch the color. I just do. Um, hmm. We can play on the brown... Ooh, this one. Okay, okay. Yeah. Let me look at this. Hold on. I'm remaking it. Yes, please don't spam, guys. My day's good. How is your day going, um, Ava? Ava Joe. Um, and then you said you like flowers. I got you, girl. And you can tell me if you don't like it. We can definitely change it out. Don't, don't feel like you have to keep the colors that I'm showing you. If you don't like it, definitely tell me. What do you think? Oh, I'm sorry, Ava. It's a pretty name. People say my name wrong all the time, so don't don't feel bad. Uh, bye, Caroline. Have a good night. Oh, yay. I'm so glad you like it. I love it. I think it's so cute. It's, like, so neutral, but it also has, like, those pretty colors. Like, this blue is so pretty. And then it plays off from the owl. I think it's adorable. Isn't it, guys? It's so pretty. My name is Melly. But yes. Okay. Perfect. Now I'm just going to show you guys how to glue the eyes on. Um, just because I know, I think someone had been asking like the past like three vlogs and I didn't do it. And I kept forgetting low-key. Like I didn't mean to forget. I just kept forgetting. Let me write this down real quick with rose. Um, and then we did neutrals. And then the blue, the dark blue ball. So I know which one's yours, Stephanie. Which pair is yours. Aren't they lovely? I thought they were so cute. So 
I'm so happy you like it. Um, let me show you how to hot glue. It's really easy. There's no, there's no way to go wrong. So all I do is make sure my eyes are where I want them, which this is exactly where I want them. This one, yes. This is lime green. Okay. So I have this little, this little dino. These eyes are not glued in, so I just make sure I know the hole that I want them in, which it'll be this one right here. Then I have my hot glue gun, which is wireless, which is amazing. Um, it did cost a pretty penny, but... And all I do is go into it with my hot glue gun, do a couple of pushes, make it come out and push my safety eye in and hold it. That's literally all I do. And I have noticed that it like melts the yarn to the um, stuffing and like to the eye. Oh, thank you. I'm so happy you like the dino. Um, it's Premier Parfait Chunky. Mm -hmm. Yeah, no, I'm sorry. Not for free. <laughs> but yeah, that's all I do to, to secure my eyes. And then I hold on to it for a couple of seconds. Hazel, I'll be 31 this year. Yeah, that exactly, Stephanie. That's exactly why I started doing it this way because mine were coming out crooked and I literally would have to like pull on them for the safe, the backing to come off for me to fix it. And so I was like, forget it. Just forget it. <laughs> so it... I feel like it burns the yarn and it melts it into the, um, the stuffing, but, um, cause it secures it really well. Like I've tried taking them off and they're, it, it's extremely hard. But yeah, I'll do this other one. So I just go into the stitch that I want to glue and make the glue come out, you can see it coming, like spewing out. So it's surrounding the eye and then I push the eye. And then sometimes of course you're gonna get like overflow and that's okay, just let it dry and then um, it'll peel off if it's on top of the, the eye. Yes, please stop asking for free crochet items. And I don't sell my crochet plushies um, online. Yeah, uh, my favorite creation, I don't have her here, so I won't be able to show her, Mary. But <laughs> self-promo, it's my uh, my Samba pattern, my my beautiful little baby Samba. She's an elephant. Yep, but that's it. That is what I do. And they're pretty secure. Very adorable. Thank you. Okay, well, um, I think that is going to be the end of this live. It's already about to be 9.50. Um, do you guys have any final questions for the last three minutes? We're going to end at 9.50. <laughs> so it'll be a good event, like a good place to stop. Thank you, Mary. That's so sweet of you. Oh, thank you, Liliana. That's so sweet. <laughs> for the dyno, I used a um, five millimeter hook. I use five mil millimeter for 
Premier Parfait Chunky. For Bernat Baby Blanket, I use seven millimeter crochet hooks. It just depends on your tension though. Um, crocheting since October 2020. It's 9.47 for me. Yes, I, I'm i pretty sure I have a... I'm pretty sure I do have a purple llama. I'm like 99.9% .9 sure I have a purple llama. I am 30. The crochet, the, sorry, the sewing sticks, I said crochet. The sewing sticks cost $16 plus ship, shipping and handling. So that's whatever Etsy, because I let Etsy decide on the shipping and handling. Um, but for me, they're $16. Oh, thank you so much, Eden. That's so sweet. Bye. Bye, Ava Jo. Of course. Thank you so much, Sandy, for being here. I can't wait to see you guys in the next live on Tuesday. Make sure you watch my video for Saturday about my dinos if you're interested in that. Uh, make sure you're subscribed and um, if you really want to be subscribed, you know, to join this crochet community. Um, I would really love to for you guys to stay. <laughs> I know people always say it feels like a FaceTime and same like I know I'm not seeing anybody um so it feels low-key a little weird but whenever I um am chatting with you guys I'm kind of looking off to read your comments so it feels like a FaceTime uh you order so you're gonna order through my Instagram um direct messages I will be looking at that or you can email me but I prefer you to do Instagram direct messages because sometimes my email will just um, kind of make it seem that it's spam and it'll put it into my spam box and I'm not going to look at my spam box. So definitely Instagram, DM me, um, and yeah, I think that's it. Oh, thank you, Mary, for subbing. I appreciate you guys. Thank you so much, Christy, Stephanie, and Jackie for being here. Seriously, I couldn't throw this live on every Tuesday and Thursday without you guys. So I really do appreciate it. Um, and I will see you guys on Saturday. If not, I will see you on Tuesday on the next live. Bye guys. Bye. Good night.